another black hero, Wilfredo Lam. Wilfredo Lam was a world-renowned Afro-Chinese Cuban artist, who built his career around reviving the Afro-Cuban spirit through art. Known primarily as a painter, he was also a skilled printmaker and worked in ceramics and sculpting. Lam's father was a Chinese immigrant, but he was raised in his mother's rich Afro-Cuban heritage. His artistic interests took him to Spain, where he studied under Fernando Álvarez de Sotomayor y Zaragoza, Salvador Dalí's teacher. His years in Spain led him to a friendship with Pablo Picasso and other famous European painters of the era. He also spent time living in France, where he was an intricate part of the thriving art community. His early works were heavily inspired by Spanish modernist painters, but he would go on to develop his own surrealist style. After more than 20 years in Europe, Lam returned to Cuba and was disheartened to see his Afro-Cuban culture at risk of being erased. Black bodies and African customs had been degraded and used as tourist props, the power of blackness that his mother and grandmother had taught him was evaporating across the island. Lam began reaching deep into his African heritage, creating figures in his work that fused human and plant elements, influences that came from African poetry and culture. In solidarity with the Cuban Revolution, he gifted a painting for the presidential palace that currently hangs in the Museo Nacional de Bellas Arts in Havana. Lam's work can be found in fine art museums all over the world, and he held hundreds of exhibits in his lifetime. Next Mary Kenner Mary Kenner was born in North Carolina and is the inventor of the sanitary belt. Thirty years before the invention of the sanitary pad, Mary created a sanitary belt that included a moisture-proof pad pocket attached to it. Due to racial discrimination, no company would distribute the product because she was a black woman. Mary also invented the toilet paper roll holder that is mounted to bathroom walls all over the world. In her lifetime, she held five patents for household and hygiene products. Did you like it? Let me know in the comments. Please subscribe, like, and share.